I, yes, I do. Good eye! And welcome to. Oh, excuse me, young. Where am I? Burgers and Beer Grill House on the Royal Mile, Edinburgh. There you go. Burgers and Beer Grill House on the Royal Mile of Edinburgh. Hello. See, that's why I picked table one, two, three outside, because that was easy to remember. Lady just told me two or three times what the name of the bar, and it just goes. So I've had to come in, it's breakfast time, so I've had to come in and get a pint, and I've ordered a cheeseburger. It's a cool bar, but, but when you come in this place, be a bit careful, because you may get freaked out by seeing yourself in the mirror, as I did. Thank you, ladies. Yeah, enjoy. Thank you. So this is me right out here, look. And the reason I picked this table, not just because it's one, two, three, it's because it's got my favorite backdrop of Adam Smith. <laughs> right there, that's a proper bronze. That is, for all you people in Thailand, that's a proper bronze. It's not made out of tin and been painted. No, proper bronze. <laughs> right, so I haven't had any breakfast. Not yet. I've been enjoying walking up and down the Royal Mile, doing a fringe festival, watching, there's a wicked guy there who's gonna breathe fire in a minute. <laughs> this is a perfect spot for me to stop and have a burger. So I'm gonna give this place, um, oh, what? Um, well, I'm gonna tell you guys if it's any good or not. So cheers. And the other thing is, I know I've gotta go out to a restaurant tonight for, for dinner, but it's all right, in Scotland, I think it's all right to drink and drive. I, I, I think it's, I'm not sure if it's legal, I think it's just tolerated. Uh, Aha, <laughs> uh -huh. BFC. I oh, know. Burger, just a simple cheeseburger. Cheeseburger, a little bit of salad, a little bit of mayonnaise, then a pint of Heineken. 22, 22 pounds. <laughs> oh, this ain't my world, is it? Do you know what I mean? And I have to go out this evening for a meal where I'll probably spend another 20 or 30 quid. So it's going to be an expensive day for me just on food. But I'm in the mood. And when you're in the mood, and you're in the place of entertainment and you're getting all this wonderful entertainment for free I really don't mind paying 22 quid for a pint and a bit, you know what I'm like <laughs> I'd struggle to pay 2 quid for a pint and a thingy but I don't mind because I'm on, it's, it is location so what are the burgers actually like? Are they any good? You know, I like to think so so let this tuck in and see how tasty is this tasty burger? Mm. That is a very nice, lightly toasted <laughs> brioche bun but that burger first bite into it you're getting that proper flame grilled flavour which you won't get in any of your Burger King or McDonald's they're not really burgers they're not they may advertise as flame grill but you instantly get that taste when you're biting into this burger And this location isn't it? When you're on the Royal Mile and you have a restaurant, you would expect to pay a little bit more. You would. The lettuce is good. There's a little bit of grease. Not too much. The right amount of grease. You always need a little bit of grease on your burger. You do. Ah. Mm. 
<laughs> so I don't know, I don't know what else to tell you. <laughs> How to pan out a food fog. I'm going to choke, choke to death on a burger. That is a tasty burger, believe me. It really is. And you do have a way, you can add mustard, mayo, tomato sauce, got all sorts of bits here. Even a license to grill. There you go, burgers and beer. That's where I am. Right there. And that's a nice little, I could, I could do with a couple of them. Wet wipes. So there you go, that is the burger. It's a tasty burger. It is a tasty pine, a pineacle. If you were wondering, it is. And it's a really cool place to sit and watch everybody go by. I can see the axe. Uh, where, where this now is day three of me being on the Royal Mile, filming the axe. I've got quite familiar with some of them. And I've seen them now walking down from there to there, which I'm quite chuffed about because um, there's a young lady who looks like Bodicea, Bodica, just walked past. I only filmed a short bit of her the other day, so I'm hoping I can film some more of her today and perhaps get some really cool photographs. So that's what I'm doing, just sitting. This, you, you know if you like to sit and watch people go by, then this is the place you need to come. And it's exactly why. I, I, I did want to face the camera the other way, but the light's all wrong, so not everything works out. Not all the time, no. I don't want to go up from here, walk down the street and have mayo all over one space. Jeez, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Man, it was good. Now, um, I have paid, I paid at the bar, so I could just, um, told them the seat number when I came in. One, two, three. Nice and easy to remember. <laughs> but I can hear some acts now starting, and I, I, I want to get back out and do more filming. So I am eager. I'm eager to get back out and do some filming of these acts. I'm also not, I'm not eager to, to end this vlog just yet. <laughs> I'm sure I can run on a bit more. <laughs> I'm sure I can. No. So you can, when it comes, if you, if you check this place out online, you get the app, you go and look at that menu. I've just come in at the base rate burger. You, you can buy them, they stack them and, and rack them really high. They do. I think you can get a triple burger, but that is going to do do me until I have my tea t tonight about five o'clock. Which I'm not um, not going to be going out. I, I want to do a review on my French restaurant because it's in a really cool place. It's a wine bar that attracts lots of ladies drinking wine, and they basically have um, what would I say? It, it's not tapas. It's kind of finger food. Uh, and stuff like that, so that suits me down to the ground because I don't want to go out and have a big meal later. Later, so I will finish my tasty burger. The thing is with this channel, right? At the moment. 
it will go back to the crazy camp and cam and I keep looking at the screen rather than the lens. That's a common mistake when I'm using the BFC. If you if you had if you'd noticed I'm I'm on the BFC, not on the um, thingy on the GoPro at the moment. But yes. So I thought well, the whole point of this food channel is is, is to fund my, my eating habits, paying for the food. So I figured if I, when I'm walking up the Royal Mile, I thought, oh, I fancy a burger and a beer. So I thought if I go in there, oh, if I make a vlog for the cooking channel, it may earn enough revenue <laughs> to pay the bill. <laughs> it may not, that's everything else. If you, don't, if you don't have a crack, you don't know, do you? Well, not like to know, so uh, there you go. I'll see, 22 pounds. I'll come back to you in a few weeks to let you know if the video actually earned 22 quid. <laughs> right. I'm just about done. And that is, it's still got that flame grilled flavour. That hasn't gone away. So guys, cheers. Until I get back on the road doing a bit more camping and start doing a bit more cooking, I'll do some food review. But food reviews while I'm here. And, and then where I'm gonna go a little bit later, it's all about location. Exactly what this place is about. Uh, it's about location. So even though you're gonna spend 22 quid on a burger and a beer, but you're in a very, very good location. Set out the front, sit anywhere in there. I just took the back seat. So you can sit on the Royal Mile, doing the fringe, get a seat, enjoying a burger and a beer. And that's not too bad. It's not too bad at all. The burger is good. It, 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 it is a very good burger. It really is. And it's a very cool, refreshing pint. So cheers. Oh. And until next time, bon appetit. Uh.